Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Ha! I told you, I told you, I told you. I know these guys. I'm talking about the Romanians. I'm Romanian by birth. I lived among them, among them, amongst them, or among, between, among, among them, between these two, among as many, among. I know how they are. I know them. And I was right. Romania will give Ukraine its patriot system. Why? Because the boss said so. Who's the boss? Whoever pays more. <laughs> In this case, the United States of America. Now, I don't know if you watched uh, my, um, uh, the program from the Duran with Alex Christoforou and Alexander Mercuris when I was invited about uh, three weeks ago or so. And over there, they kept asking me about Romania. Romania, what do you think about Romania? And I said, no, Romania is owned is owned by the United States of America completely. And they were you know, pushing me like, uh, I, maybe they were skeptical. No, these guys are owned. These guys are owned. And remember, Ukraine said, oh, we need Romania's patriot system. I think there's only one. <laughs> and the Romanian uh, president, who is their boy, says, oh, yeah, 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 we, we, when he visited Washington, maybe a month ago he said yeah we can figure things out yeah if the price is right but the defense minister said oh, yeah, yeah. they they pretend that they uh, negotiate or maybe they it was a done deal we know that now we have this article from Ukraine from from Ukraine form where they how should I put it, confirm that Romania is moving in that direction with both legs or both feet uh, you know, in Romania, when in the apartment buildings, um, when they would get the deceased person being in the kostyug, in the casket, you would get him outside of the house with the feet f first, not with the head, with the feet out, and then so he doesn't come back. You know what I mean? If you bring like that, I don't want to go. I'm coming back later. <laughs> All right. So the same here. Romania is going with both feet towards this. Look over a map and see where Romania is in relation to uh, Russia. So this comes from Ukraine form. It is from um, the 3rd of June 2024. Romania looking into donating Patriot system to Ukraine. I don't think it has only one, but let's see. Romanian officials, Romanian officials are discussing the idea of providing Ukraine with a Patriot air defense system. Why? Because the other ones were blown up by the Russians. No, 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 no. It's just to protect, uh, um, I would say, it's going to be... What's the name of that city, man, with O? Odessa, Jesus Christ, probably. So nevertheless, Romania applies the same method, learned from the other guys, small steps, small increments, pack, 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 until they got the baboons. Oh, yeah, we're going to give it. They'll give them all. Why not? The Americans are here to protect you. Do you have an army? And <laughs> what kind of fucking fat fuck army you got? No, anyway, let's read this garbage. According to the Romanian president, the Romanian Klaus Johanni, Johannes, uh, mind you, um, the decision must be approved by the Supreme Council of National Defense. I guarantee you that would be approved. And we'll see, da, 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 let's move on. In an interview, Prime Minister Marcel Cholacu, oh, just look at his face, like a wet rat, noted that the body should take into account all information available around the issue. That means give us some money and we're going to give you the Patriot. Romanians are not stupid. Not stupid. Never said they are stupid, but they have other qualities. And I'm quoting, in the first place, the specialists must speak, he said, Cholaku. <laughs> and I'm quoting, this, do, this does not mean that if a system covers part of Ukraine, it does not also cover Romania. <laughs> oh my God, man, these guys really think that someone is a baboon somewhere. Yeah, there are a lot of them. Now, here is about the specialist sitting at the table and finding the best solutions and then the SCND can make the decision with all available information so that it takes the best decision. Romanians, uh, we have laws, we Romanians, we have laws. 
it's hard to implement them <laughs> and to follow them. I will tell you a story. So, at this moment, the proposal is under analysis, I guarantee you. Cholaku added that he could not unilaterally make such decision, even though he would like to. And I'm quoting, if you want me to make a decision now on the show, I can't. Oh, come on, Cholak, you can do it. You will. <laughs> I'm not a specialist. I'm the Prime Minister of Romania. I have to listen in an institutional framework, a secret one. Ooh, this, oh, fuck, man. It is because it is a decision regarding Romania's defense. Oh, they care about you and us. And then we make this, the decision together. The head of the government emphasized that this is not the kind of discussion that should be held in public. Ooh. Now, let me tell you, this is a mockery. This is a mockery. I will tell you a little story. It was a, a, it was a book. You can find it, maybe. It's called Where the Black Man Rules. I think that's what it is. It talks about Haiti. And it was a British guy, a liberal guy at those times. I think it was at the beginning of the 20th century. He visits Haiti, that island over there, the Haiti. And uh, Haiti being a, uh, used to be a colony, a French colony and all that. And he was helped over and over by the Americans, by everybody. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so he goes over there with, uh, you know, like the diversity, inclusion, that kind of uh, um, framework, mindset, like one of those guys. And he goes over there and he says, oh, guys, do you have here a, um, a hospital? Yeah, 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 we have one. A military hospital. They go to a military hospital. He go and finds a room with a broken, you know, all that. Not a hospital. Do you have here a power? power? Yeah, we have electrical power plants. And they get to a power plant built by a long time ago. Non-functional. Do you have here, I don't know, roads? Yeah, 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 we have roads. All damaged. And all. They have everything. But they don't. And they have more generals than the military. Read that book. Read that book. So the same with, with Romanians. We have everything here. We have malls. We have freeways. We have laws. We have a framework. We are democrats. We are, we, 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 but when it's about applying it, ba baboons. That's how it is. Don't believe me? Don't have to. Come and live in Romania for a while and deal with... Uh, <clears throat> I'm not here to bash Romania because I left the country with a sour heart, a very, very sour heart, because I couldn't find these uh, um, windmills here. But anyway, so that was, th this is what Cholaku, and the other one where he says that, um, with, with the laws, I was walking in Bucharest, with a, there are laws, Romania has laws, all the countries, all countries have laws. The problem is how you implement them, if you in enforce them. I went to Romania and beautiful boulevard, beautiful. And I was walking, pam, 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 pam. And on the sidewalk, a big sidewalk, there, uh, next to some you know, uh, two-way and two-way, so four, four lanes, beautiful trees. It was nice, nice neighborhood. Each and there were some big metal rods, like this thick in the ground, pam, 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 all along and in the, um, so this is the, the sidewalk like that. It was not only like this along, uh, uh, okay, not only along, along it, like it was like this as well, pam, 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 pam. You know why? So cars cannot park on the sidewalk. The sidewalk was like a line, like a highway lane. So, instead of just let the people park over there and have the police go over there and give them the tickets, civilize the baboons, you know, they put those metal rods so they cannot get in. Do you understand what I'm talking about? I wouldn't have put anything. I would just make, I, I would just have a cop there every day to issue tickets and make sure that those parking tickets will be paid big fucking sums and the Romanians will become civilized. How do you think the Americans got civilized? Exactly like that. Exactly like that. With laws that they have implemented and you have a force that's gonna go over there. Yeah, there's corruption too. But those guys, they avoid it by putting those metal rods. And it looks like crap. But you know why those rods are over there? Instead of just saying, oh no, the police officer is gonna issue and those guys will have to go over there and pay the fines, big fucking fines. I'm telling you, they will be civilized just like this. I can tell you, I will tell you a lot of stories 
in about two months about Romania, my visit to Romania, and it's not gonna be good. A lot of things, I mean, a lot of things are good. I saw a lot of good things, but I will give you this example. The same, the same monkey riding the bike, all right? Like some of you say, well, we do, the, yeah, we, 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 no, 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 you're just a monkey riding a bike. You have moles, yeah, beautiful. Built by, mm, great, clean, beautiful. But when you go over there, people use their elbows and they get inside. They are rude. They are my direct experience. So the same, you know, in a different environment. Environment, just physical environment. Their milieu is the same. Well, maybe it's the area where I'm at. I don't know. I'm telling you, I know. But nevertheless, what's going on over here? They will give the Patriot system and they will give everything because that's not theirs. I mean, what are they going to do? They have NATO troops over there in Romania all over the place. Hercules uh, transport planes flying from Banasa all day long. I see them. Um, there are trucks carrying, I don't even know what kind of uh, um, installations those are. And I know the direction, but I tell you right now, they're going north. Thank you very much. Towards Moldova. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth. And hey, Romanian friends, if you don't like what I'm saying, I would be inclined to say that you're like them. Because I found too many of them like that. So maybe you change your behavior and civilize yourself with some tickets instead of putting those fucking rods in the middle of the mm, sidewalk. See you later.